When you mouse over a tool, callouts appear to explain what the tool does. Extruded Boss Base extrudes a sketch in one or two directions. Let's right click on the Evaluate tab and scroll down to Customize Command Manager. Here's where we enable or disable the Command Manager. We can choose to use large or small buttons with text. We can specify the button size, the text size, whether we want to show tool tips, use large tool tips, and so on. Here's the checkboxes for tool tips. If you right click on the tools themselves, you'll see a few more options to show text or not, to show the text below, begin a group, and to delete the tool. Next, we've got the Shortcut Bars tab. Here we can choose between four different environments, Parts, Assembly, Drawing, and Sketch. To add a tool to the Shortcut Bar, just grab it from the left and drag it onto the Shortcut Bar on the right. To remove a tool, just grab it from the bar and drag it back to the left. By the way, this is not a graphic representation of the toolbar. This is the actual floating toolbar. To activate or deactivate it, just press S on your keyboard. Let's right-click here and get back to the Customize Command Manager dialog window. Let's go to the Commands tab now. Here's where we access the commands to associate with any particular category.